In Argentina, the International Working Women's Day was commemorated with demonstrations throughout the country, rejecting the administration's adjustment and to stop the advance of the anarchist capitalist administration on rights conquered during years of struggles such as the decriminalization of abortion, among many others. More details in the following report. One of the main activities took place in front of the National Congress, where hundreds of women from different political positions gathered, sharing the same demands. Before we felt, little by little, we were making progress. And once again, we went backwards. And not only backwards, but downwards. They're trying to sink us, and luckily we can all join forces and be here today. When we were on the train, many girls were asking us if we were going to come here. Many could not come because they had to work. And they were not given the day, not only because they were women. It is one day. What can they do for not going one day? Jubilada, retirees, mothers, students and workers demanded the right to a dignified life. This March 8th, with a lot of poverty, with a lot of misery, Milady is starving us to death. The soup kitchens, the food is not delivered. Women go out to work day by day. We don't really have anything in our houses. To see our fridge empty is shocking. To see our children go to school without anything. To see the rent, how people are living on the streets. So this March 8th is very sad. Malay's administration adjustment impacts all aspects of women's lives. We are very aware of the feminist movement at the international level that this is an advance of the right wing, not only in Argentina, but in many of our countries. And the popular movements, the feminist movement, the popular feminism, as it has always been, will always be at the forefront of the struggle. There was a unanimous rejection of the national government's decision to change the name of the Women's Hall to the Hall of Heroes in the Casa Rosada. It is an outright provocation to continue encouraging hatred and division and disrespect for the struggle that we have been building for years and the rights won by the women. The massive demonstrations condemned the emergency decree and the attempt to overturn the law on the voluntary interruption of pregnancy. Carolina Silvestre, Telesur, Buenos Aires.